A 2 o'clock start for the Jackals allowed them to just get in the last game of their series against Quebec before the storm. The first pitch was delayed a half hour, but the rain held out for the entire game. The lineup was the same as usual today, while John Lucas took the mound looking for his fifth win of the season. Things would not go well for the Jackals in this one as they allowed six runs before getting one back here in the bottom of the third on a sack fly from Jeremy Barnes. Rob Benedict would score easily and Chris Curran would move to third. He would score on the next at bat when Brandon Jones grounds out to first to make the score 6-2. to two. Then in the top of the sixth, same score, Chris Curran makes possibly the best play of the year. He ran a mile to get this one, laying out to make the spectacular catch. If the Jackals don't lead the league in highlight reel catches, they're certainly up there. The Jackals would score one more in the bottom of the seventh. Chris Kern grounds into a double play, and Jose Cuevas would score, but it would not be enough. The Jackals won the series, but would lose this one 9-3. The final score of today's game, La Capitale de Quebec 9, New Jersey Jackals 3. Fans, the Jackals, thank you for attending today's game here at Yogi Berra Stadium. Sundays at Yogi Berra Stadium aren't just for dollar hot dogs. After the game, kids got to run the bases, have catch in the outfield, and get some autographs from the team. The next fun day Sunday is August 11th, and the next home game is an 11 a.m. start on Wednesday, July 31st. Jackals fans, remember to like us on Facebook, follow us at Jackals Baseball on Twitter, and go to Jackals.com for tickets, info, and more.